to week six of the process, we're back to taking responsibility. We love this challenge of week one, week three, and week six. We feel it's that important to eliminate excuses from your vocabulary. We want it gone. We want you to never back down because of an excuse that will prohibit you from reaching your dreams. So we need to get rid of them. Okay, and again, we're going to ramp this up. So, as a reminder, over the next seven days, you're going to write down excuses that you make that are dream-related. So again, as the example, I cannot train today because it's too cold and rainy. You're also going to write excuses down that are non-dream-related. This is if you can't do your homework today because you need to play more Fortnite or something along the lines of that. Now, in terms of cost or consequence, every time you make a mistake, you do 20 burpees in week, week six. That's dream related. If it's non-dream related, you do 20 squats. It's all about pushing yourself to eliminate making excuses. Because remember, you have a schedule that you built out. You know when you need to be doing your certain things. So don't let excuses ruin your schedule. Get through it, get it done, and then move forward. All right? So follow up. If, we, if you need to use the templates again, we have it. You can go back to a week one and three before and see what your excuses were. And hopefully you're seeing that every day and every week that you're doing this, it's less and less. If not, you're going to be in a heck of good shape. So keep that up at least. But it's time for you to take responsibility. If you're going to be a pro in the future, you need to own this. The best professionals do not make excuses. They just get after it. You need to do the same thing. So get on it. Do it for the next seven days, and we'll see you next week.